today I have a very fun video for you guys. Today I am going to be showing you guys what I eat in a day. This is realistic. This is exactly what I'm going to be eating today. I am not going to make this up. I'm not going to make it seem like I'm a really healthy person on a daily basis. Like I try to eat good um, as much as I can. Obviously I do have like days where I'm just like, you know what, I fancy a croissant for the morning. I fancy a bag of crisps. You know, I do switch it up. So I'm going to be showing you guys exactly what I have now. Um, staying at home in quarantine. This is a realistic what I eat in a day. So I'm really excited to show you guys what I eat. I do like to point out that I do like to eat quite healthy-ish. Well, I try to anyways. There is days where I just kind of binge on all the snacks I can but there's days where I like to maintain a healthy diet and um, I'm all about balance I like to put that out there I'm all about balance I don't I'm not really one of those that just kind of a strict diet eat healthy no cheese no carbs I'm not like that I'm all about balance so that is pretty much my diet so yeah I'm gonna be showing you guys everything I eat today so I'm really excited so yeah without this long intro if you guys want to see what I eat in a day then let's get on with the video okay so i've pretty much woken up showered put my face on got ready for the day and now it's time for breakfast i don't know about everyone else but i am one of those as soon as i wake up i look forward to breakfast breakfast is like literally key for me so today i am gonna go and make myself some um oats i'm gonna have some porridge i've got such a busy day ahead of me i've got to film edit do emails clean the house yeah, I've got quite a lot of stuff to get up to today because the house is a bit of a tip. I'm not going to lie, this weekend we just literally did nothing. So the house is a tip. I really need to tidy the house and just kind of get a lot of things done. So yeah, I think porridge is going to keep me nice and full and going to kind of keep me going for a good few hours. So that's what I'm going to have. I'm going to start off the day good, have some porridge and I have some strawberries left to eat before they go off. So yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Um, porridge is definitely on the agenda so let's go and make some food later okay so i have been sitting here for so long editing my brain is about to explode so i was first sitting nicely on my desk you know getting work done as you do and then i've resulted to my bed and then the sofa and now i'm back in bed editing this video so long by the way guys but it's gonna be worth it in the end when you guys watch it so i'm really excited and um, for you guys to see it i probably look like a mess right now and my scarf's all over the place but you know what who cares anyways um i am really feeling a hot drink now like it comes to about midday and i'm like you know what a hot drink is definitely on the agenda so i think i'm gonna go and make myself a mint tea so guys i wanted to quickly talk to you guys about my um new obsession oh my god guys this is no joke when i say this but i have been trying out the new sultan tea range and honestly i am not just saying this i absolutely love it my favorite hands down is the moroccan mint tea it literally is just like the best thing ever it's so refreshing just makes you feel so good i don't know like how to describe like i'm not the best at describing tea but honestly it's literally like my go-to now like every time i fancy tea i'm like oh um, should i go for that um sultan tea has been running for 86 years so if it's one brand that knows about tea it's definitely them they've been going for like what three centuries nearly so it's kind of it's been a long time so um i definitely trust their teas because they literally taste amazing and obviously if they've been running for that long they pretty much know about tea that's for sure they do a massive range of tea they do the english breakfast tea they do mint teas they do exotic teas they do like caramel chai so there's quite a massive range that they do so um, I definitely crave a good old um, Moroccan tea. I think I'm going to go outside, get some fresh air in my lungs and have my tea. But that is one thing I'm currently obsessed with. If you haven't tried it, I would highly recommend trying them out. I'll leave them linked in the description box below, by the way, because um, 
this would literally be ideal to have like after you break your fast in ramadan i just literally can't wait to have it it's going to be good for your digestive system there's like so many benefits to it as well it's all 100 percent natural too um so i'm really really excited for that um so that's what i'm gonna do i'm gonna have my tea and then get back to this i love that for me since i last spoken to you guys and it's well and truly a time for lunch i am so hungry i feel like the oats kept me a nice and full which was great but i have been really busy like editing replying back to emails like getting a lot of housework done so i feel like i'm burnt off all the food ready so i think it's definitely time for a good lunch and today I, I was kind of like in two minds i wasn't too sure what to have for lunch but i think i crave the jack potato because i haven't had it in literally the longest time ever and i was kind of scrolling through instagram and i saw one person like posted her lunch and she had jack potato and it looked really nice so i thought you know what jack potato it is so that's what i'm gonna have um i have just a normal jack potato four for like i think it's two pounds i bought it from aldi like the really like the frozen ones that's freddie made i know i'm really lazy sorry but yeah i'm probably gonna have that pop it in the microwave and um, heat up some beans and pop some cheese and beans yeah basic cheese and beans basically um that's what i'm gonna have for lunch i am really excited i am really hungry and yeah the weather is so beautiful today so you know what i'm gonna go get some vitamin d make my lunch sit outside for a good half an hour just soak up the heat and then i'm gonna get back to work so yeah after lunch um i have a video to film hence why i've actually got makeup on today guys i don't usually wear makeup on a daily basis but that's what i'm gonna do make lunch and then sit outside let's go <laughs> o'clock now and we're just gonna prep for dinner so for dinner we're gonna have we're pretty much gonna eat what we have at home because we're trying to eat up before we do another shop before we do another shop exactly and obviously being quarantined and stuff we want to eat up as much as we can at home so we're gonna have cheese and onion pastry we said a mashed, potatoes. Um, a mashed potato on the sides and broccolini. then a broccolini which is our favorite adam makes the best broccolini so i think that's what we're gonna have just eat up what we have at home and yeah have that for lunch i look like a mess right now please ignore me when it comes towards the end of the evening look at ma look at me fam i just look like a mess i, I need a haircut uh, yeah desperately i also did like a good 15 minute hit workout so <laughs> yeah my heart is still racing and i'm still out of breath so please ignore that but yeah um excited for dinner some nice hearty warm dinner do you know what i mean yeah i don't know what you mean <laughs> has kicked in <laughs> you're right there you just look a statue it's weird <laughs> Okay guys, so dinner is served. So we made some, this is such a random dinner by the way guys, but we're just eating what we have at home. So yeah, um, made some broccolini, um, this is cheese and onion pastry, some leftover beans from today, today's lunch. Mm -hmm. And what is this? Oh yeah, creamy mash. And that's mine and this is adults. Double as always. Double as per. So yeah, we're gonna dig in and enjoy. Slap.
Okay, so we've just finished dinner. I'm just gonna have our multivitamins. What well, I usually have my multivitamins usually um straight after breakfast, but I totally forgot to today for some reason. So Oh what's that? Bunny rabbit! <laughs> so we're gonna have it now. So we don't forget. Multivitamins are so important guys. Especially Doctor Leo. Doctor especially now. I mean, uh, Especially now in quarantine, it's really good to um, boost your immune system. So having like oranges, lemons. You know. Okay, so the ones that we have on a daily basis are these. These are from Holland and Barrett. So like I mentioned, we usually have this after breakfast, but totally forgot today. So after dinner. Okay guys, so that is the end of the video. This is pretty much what we would eat, what I would eat in a day. Random foods. Yeah, very <laughs> random, just eating what we have at home. So um, if later on I get a bit peckish, I'll probably maybe like cut up some fruits and have that. Do you miss going out to eat? Mm, no, you asked me that question yesterday, I said no. I literally don't miss going out to eat. Because I've been making so many different things at home, uh, I feel like, you know what? Well, we've you know, it's like things. that environment going out. Environment, Day yeah. Night. Socially, yeah. But the food, no. Because when you have a takeaway, when you have like bad food, you just feel so sluggish and nasty after it. Because we've had a lot more time on our hands now that we're all in quarantine, I feel like we're making different foods and different meals. And it's so nice because we're trying different things out. And I, you feel a lot better. And the food is like... Just makes you feel good, do you know what I mean? Anyways, so yeah, that is everything um, I've eaten today. Like I mentioned, if I do get a bit peckish later on around nine, I'll probably make myself a cuppa with like some biscuits or I'll just cut up from some fruits. But that's if I do get hungry. If not, then that's me pretty much sorted. Well, I'm, I'm actually, always hungry. I'm actually really bloated. That meal really filled us up quite nice. Alhamdulillah. Fair. Alhamdulillah. So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, don't forget to smash that thumbs up. And I will leave everything I mentioned in the description box below. Subscribe if you haven't already. That's the adult's favorite word to say it every, every single one of my videos. Subscribe if you haven't already. But yeah, um, I shall see you guys really, really soon in my next video. Bye.